that uh, believed him and wanted to support someone who was purporting to be a victim should be embarrassed because we need to believe people yeah. that are saying that they were victims right. Right. of hate crimes. The person, if this is all true, that should be embarrassed is Jesse Smollett. He should be embarrassed yeah. for taking advantage of, of our story kindness if it's true. I mean, all I see is this on the news now. This is yeah. the big story. It's wiped everything away well, until, just, Ma until Michael Cohen talks next Wednesday. Well, that's, that's, this is what yeah. we're yeah. going to hear. Well, I, I am trying to convince Joy Behar to live tweet the Michael Cohen testimony. Yeah, that'll never happen. But you know what, you know what I would happened. like to say? Mm -hmm. what, what is upsetting about this being front page news is yeah. that hate crimes are on the rise. Mm -hmm. And the yeah. thing that we're not talking about In is New the York. domestic terrorist, 49-year-old Christopher Paul Hassan, there you go. who's the U.S. Coast Guard yeah. lieutenant, mm -hmm. a white supremacist who was hiding in plain sight, dreamed of mass murder. Yeah. He plotted to target lawmakers, journalists, including my friends Chris Cuomo, Don Lemon, Van Jones, Angela Davis, Elizabeth Warren, and Kamala, you know, Kamala Harris, Cory Booker, and somehow, and you know, his hate is real. And we're not talking about that. How about my two guys? And your Chris two guys. Gaines and Ari Mo I know, and Ari I thought Mo of you. Really, that's because, freedom of speech. Because we worship at the cult of celebrity in this country, we have a reality yeah. television star, and it ultimately will dominate the news. Uh -huh. That's one of the conversations we're having yeah. right now. And I do agree, this should be getting as much attention. Right? Well, well, yeah. Yeah. Okay. say he's innocent also? Because well, his lawyer, I don't know if you just said this, but he said negative thoughts about people are not a, is not a crime. Yeah. Well, but so I, is he going to get off also, this guy? But you we'll know, see who his lawyer is. But if you Google right. Mein Kampf and things like that, that is a crime. If, okay. Or you're at least alerted. If you're Googling, like, how to build a bomb and things like that, and this guy was a crime. We also, yeah, but we by also, the way, negative, I, I think you're put on a thank list. Thank God negative thoughts about people are not a crime. Right. <laughs> oh, uh, uh, yeah. but, but this, we'd, be, we'd be in there for life. When but, I was a kid, I grew up Catholic. Or maybe some of you have grown up Catholic. It was yeah. a sin to have an evil thought. No, I grew up more I than I got it. There were a lot of things that were a sin when we grew up. But this guy, <laughs> this guy plotted was going to plot yeah. like a, a mass genocide, yeah. and we haven't heard yet. I don't think weapons by well. the president All yet those on this. Weapons can't be legal. Oh. No. Oh, we have a legal note. I'm is. sorry. Uh, Smollett's attorneys released a, a statement following saying, like any other citizen, Mr. Smollett enjoys the presumption of innocence, particularly when there has been an investigation like this one, where information, both true and false, has been reportedly leaked. Given these repeatedly circumstances, leaked. repeatedly leaked, yeah. sorry. Uh, given these circumstances, we intend to conduct a thorough investigation and to mount an aggressive defense. Okay. Coming up, our Oscar predictions. We'll be right back.